Hello and welcome to some Be Open here at Chicagoland. We've got ourself, ourselves a uh, strength of field here today. 4.9 strength of field. I'm the 18 car. That is one of the highest numbers I've had in a long time. And uh, I've lost some I rating recently, but I'm still 4.9. So to be able to get the uh, number 18 car is pretty cool. Um, less cool is the musical chairs with setups I've been doing. <laughs> I've got the newest OSR setup, I've got an older OSR setup, and I've got a free setup shop setup from forever ago that I've kind of been trying. I've been trying all three of them and I can't decide which one I like most. Uh, and as you can see, now I am uh, familiar with all three, but good at none of them. So, I'm a little concerned. I feel like I did not get the right amount of practice that I needed to get done. Because I just, I kept switching setups. I'm like, no, I, I, let me try this one then, and then... It's just it's not great. So I'm gonna try the high line here. Maybe I can be more stable. It's not looking good though. Got some extra tape on this thing. It's okay if we start farther back though. That's fine with me. Yeah, that's not good at all. 30.7. I'm gonna be near the back. I don't even think I want to go with this setup. I might switch it again right at the last second. In fact, I think I will. <sighs> this is what I'm saying. Like, I couldn't decide which setup because the OSR setup didn't feel very good. It feels like it's bottoming out in the middle of the corner. It's the bumps are just affecting it so bad. But the other setups weren't really much better. And hmm. Now I, I just, I'm not good at any of the setups. I haven't learned any of them well enough, so. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll just go with the latest OSR. We'll uh, take our terrible qualifying lap. And we'll just be patient. We'll see what we can get. I mean, technically we just got to finish 18th or higher to finish where we're expected. So we'll, uh, we'll give it a go. But not feeling too confident, I must admit. So we uh, see some lots of familiar names in here. Okay, if Colton, you've your engine temperatures ever been in any higher strength of field open races in some of the NASCAR stuff. Just kind of looking through, seeing some of the numbers we've got in here. I got you know guys in the six thousands, you know, all the way. Well, let's, uh, let's do like this. We've got from the top guy with an 8.8K down to 31, which is still a 3.4K. And then we are right here with our 4.9. So I could easily get just the doors blown off me here. <laughs> that could easily happen. Since I, I'm not comfortable with any of the setups I've been working with, these free setups and very strong drivers. I'm, I personally am not feeling all too comfortable yet. So you can see there's just a huge gap even between me and the guy just directly in front of me. That's just the end a of the full two tanks. Noah's a good guy to have in front of you though. I can probably watch him and learn some stuff. So uh, yeah, I guess uh, we're about ready to go. Lots of people, well, not a lot, but a nice handful of people didn't qualify, so I hope they're not going to just blast through me in a rush to uh, qualify on lap one, which some people just love to do for some reason. Going to keep the water temps and stuff up here. Tommy, what happened to you on the front stretch in the last one? Last lap. So it is Monday night. Small brain. Part of why there's uh, such a strong field here tonight. Not the first race of the week in B Open, but one of the first ones. 
Oh, look at that. The number two is a pro driver. I didn't know that. Yeah, I just I just come out of four or five laps down as I was doing and just see you playing around in the ball field. wonder if uh, any more of the guys in here are pro drivers, like the one or something. We don't have enough data for that. All right. Got my crew chief ready to help me out with pit strategy if we need it. Hopefully we get some uh, green flag pit stops. Did a couple of practice stops. Bit of a tough pit road to get onto here. I think I should be able to pull it off though. We'll see. But even that I didn't get as much practice because well, I was trying to get enough normal practice done before even worrying about that. And I didn't get much of anything done. <laughs> but uh, I've got a good braking marker. Now, uh, for when I want to start getting into the pits. So yeah, not too three, concerned about that. I feel like I can do it, even if it's going to be a little bit have slow. I feel like at least I won't uh, speed or anything if I hit my marks. 90 laps. The track temp is Starting eight. on the outside the in 18th, 19. we will have the Geico restart zone implemented, Follow as is the norm. 26. In, the outside column. in these NASCAR series now. I think it's A, B, and C does it. I don't think the ARCA series does it. I just did a race at Kentucky and it did. they didn't have that. Jetsa so I guess it's just these top car. series maybe that does it. Jetsa Seems to be right. Car. Pretty big field, 31 cars, if I remember correctly. Last week, my first attempt of B Open, I died before I even got to the start finish line because everyone was checking up on the start, like people not hitting the gas whenever the green flag came out, and then people were rear ending each other in front of me, and I couldn't slow down in time, and the people behind me slammed into me, and then my engine was overheating immediately. So that wasn't great. Hopefully, that doesn't happen again here. Maybe a first gear start. Let's see. I remember I want to be patient though. Maybe second gear then. No reason to throw myself into the fire immediately. Watch the light carries off. Time to do your job. Green, green, green. Yep. Checking up a little bit. Inside. Alright, so far so good. Still there at the bottom. Nose really likes to push. We three wide. Pretty close to it, I think. Yep, we are three wide already. Why? Who knows? Oh god, something's happening. Someone backed out, I guess. Still up top three wide. Oh, they're running into... Uh-oh. Scary, scary, scary. Four wide. Scary, 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 scary. <laughs> oh boy. Fucking lap two, and we're demolished because you can't replace it. Yeah, lots of impatience, it would seem. Holy cow, this is uh, this already started off pretty wild. Kinda like to get to the bottom, I think that's the tire saving lane. That's some more air push than whenever, uh, well, obviously, than whenever you're alone here. So it's making the car a little tighter. 
than uh, it was in practice for me. Okay, okay. Pitting, Who's pitting? <laughs> I can't pay attention to how many. There's like 30 people around me right now. I was afraid someone was gonna die immediately down. You never know what to expect here. 19 wants to go, we'll let him go. I see a little bit of a gap behind him. I'm really trying to save my tires right now, too, and it's kind of hard to do when you're forced to run whatever line's actually available. Let's get single file, huh? Jeez. I feel like I've been three wide since the start of this one. Jesus. I cut that close. Still just trying to get comfortable here. down there or something. I don't know. I know some guys have damage right now. I don't know who. I don't know if he's one of them or what, but... I guess I'm still on his outside. Clear inside. Inside. Clear inside. Alright. Can we settle down a little bit now? So we are in what, 17, 16th maybe? Sounds about right. Alright, now can't, can't go a single lap without being side by side at some point. Go. If you're gonna pass me, go. <laughs> Alright. So, 17th. Can we be single file for at least a little bit now? I'd like to take a tire saving line. Just at least for a little bit, maybe? I didn't even feel like I'm saving tires. I felt like it got tight. I'm lifting off pretty good. I feel like it's necessary to really lift off on entry to get the nose not to push as much. Not sure uh, how well this is going to go. Thanks, Bob. Thank you. I don't know. We'll see what long run pace we have or don't have. Really tough competition here today though, so... Again, not expecting too much. This feels so tight. No one really cut in the apron. Doesn't seem to provide too much benefit in a car like this. Oh my god, it's so tight! Gosh. Car in 
Say thanks. I'm, I'm just that slow. I wasn't even necessarily landing on my. I'm just that slow. Though I'm not fighting him either. I am lifting off pretty good. I don't think we have much here today. Hopefully it turns around long run or something, but I'm not expecting it to. I think guy's just flying past me now. Clears me. Not gonna do any sort of crossover or anything. Eh? I wish this car turned a little bit more. I'm gonna be honest. I feel really tight. Feels like I just I have to be really patient on the throttle or throttle or else it's just gonna go straight towards the wall. And I just it feels like we're going backwards. We're not certainly not gaining any speed as the run goes on. Not feeling too great, unfortunately, at the moment. turns around. And I don't mean my car spinning around, I mean our momentum. Though at least it would be turning if the car turned around. Is 26 falling off or something? Got a couple guys side by side right now. Not sure if we're faster than either or if they're just slowing each other down at the moment. Oh my gosh, he really chopped his nose there. Oh, someone in the wall up there. He's getting a run on us. Inside. He'll put it down there. Stay high. Keep high. Clear. Inside. Don't want to stay on his outside, so we go a little higher in the dial over, Clear over inside. here, whatever. V21. Outside. Keep right. 15's going on our outside. He's got some speed, it looks like. It really gripped up for him out there. We are just going backwards. Put him the lane up there. This car is so tight. Yikes, man. Keep 
Why would you stick your nose out there, man? I've got to drift out to the wall. And my car's tight. That's such a dangerous thing to do to somebody. Oh well. We figured it out. I continue my march to the rear. It's okay though, right? We'll save tires and pass everybody later, right? Totally. Definitely gonna happen. This is not shaping up to be a very good finish for us. <laughs> push right there. Car not turning. It's just hitting the bumps and just nose is pushing. Really not uh, driver friendly here. Close to the wall there. I kind of just stayed in it. Trusted I wasn't going to get into the wall. Thankfully I didn't. Probably don't want to be rolling those dice all too often though. Might have something for the 17 here. Maybe. take his lane, but I think we can. Probably was a little bit too sheepish there. I didn't want to cut him off. I thought he'd have more of a run than that though. Seemed like it was okay in the end, but just being careful. No reason to cut it too close at this point in the race. I'm obviously not in a hurry to get anywhere. Question. I don't know what my tires are doing compared to other people. Good consistency. Keep it coming. been a very clean race so far. A little scary on the start, but seems like everybody's holding it together now. Not, not falling behind this little group ahead at the moment, so that's nice. Oh, someone down on the apron. Something must have happened. Okay, Hunter. Your engine temperatures are okay. All clear from engine Seems temperatures. like everyone's heading the right direction still. Getting a little bit of looseness on the exit of four. That's feeling kind of nice. Car's actually doing something. 
instead of being just pure tight. Maybe it's uh, maybe it's coming to us here. Looks like our lap times might be getting a little bit faster. We're catching up to the 16. 23rd place. You've just done a 32.5. Your water temperature looks quite Oh my goodness. He was very sideways. Outside. Go low. Make sure not to overdrive it. Thanks for telling me you're pitting. Right now, down low. Stay low. There's a car on the high side. Keep low. Right. V21. That lap was up. 32.7. Right. All dead four. Somebody yeah, just all dead four, apparently. I think that was the pro driver. Decided he wasn't having fun. I don't know. Stay low. There's a car on the high side. Guy really sticking on our outside, though. He's just gonna keep us here all day. us off and now we're losing a spot. The moment I thought we were moving forward. Now all of a sudden we're moving back again. Outside. We've been cleared. Thank you. Well, I went from maybe gaining a spot to I lost a spot. Yeah, looks like we're ready to race too. try to pass on the outside. Seems like we just couldn't carry enough momentum on the bottom. The lap time was at 32.8. Okay, Colton. The lap times are pretty consistent. Oh. window is open. Interesting that it's so close. I guess theoretically if you pit on lap 37 or something like that you wouldn't make it, huh? Curious. Curious. Oh, someone getting loose. That for a second, I, maybe they were pitting? I don't know. I can't tell if they were pitting <laughs> or it got loose or got loose and then decided to pit. <laughs> I'm not sure which the uh, what the order was there. Yellow down here, you're at the bottom of the here again. Whoa, what's going Thanks, on up Dad. there? You weren't clear, dude. Is he coming up on track? You bought a temperature looks quite high. No. I had to be careful though, I was a little hesitant to get back on throttle because I didn't know where it was going to be. Yeah, we were free wide. Yeah, they look like they're about to wreck. I'm at the very bottom. Might have to wait on pitting. 
the United States be checking up for them wrecking the quarter lap before them? Yeah. Just getting barreling in? Dude, I had looked fine, I was about holding the line. Got some angries. Some angries are happening. I mean, Christian didn't check up either, so if you're gonna rip me one, rip him one too, will ya? I thought I didn't hit anything. What was your problem? All right, Colton. I might wait a little out here because they're still really close racing. We got guys running into each other apparently. Top, middle, bottom. Oh, 15 sideways. Yikes. Getting weird. What is this 15 doing? It's a car between the car outside. You right, there was a car on the high Man, side. they just killed that yellow car. Outside is clear. Got the car outside. Outside is clear. Had to get on the brakes. Had to drift up into the 30 there. That guy's got some serious damage. Had to ease onto it, not to drift up into him. He's got down on power. He's straight. Alright. Finally clearing that mess. Guy's pitting in. That guy's on fresh tires. But didn't we block him? I might wait. And that's why. Alright. Interesting. Line up single file behind car number 30. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. So we'll come get everything. Don't we'll pit without saying anything, maybe? Hopefully, we get caught up to the field and see what we can do here. Never really got close on. Overheating, so I'm gonna put another percent of tape on there. And, uh, well, that's probably not gonna do anything, but I'll do it anyway. And we should be good on fuel to the end. No green flag pit stops for us today. Not sure, uh, who missed out on that. Exchange. There might be some people that ended up in a bad spot because of that. We do not catch the field properly, unfortunately. Watch your speed. Pit lane speed limit is 50 miles per hour. We'll pull you to the end. Five, three, two, one. Right here. Ooh, almost slid a bit too far. 52.65, not great. I'll admit it, not great. <laughs> okay, punch it. Alright, probably about the same spot. Don't think anything crazy happened, unless we had some other people that slid past the box or something. See the fourth place guy maybe back there? Uh, hard to tell, because I don't know where everybody's pit boxes were. Or 
didn't really pay attention to the names around me or anything. But like I said, good on fuel, don't have to worry about that. Pits are open. So not feeling too very too fast. Blade? We'll just uh we'll hang in there. I have damage. Like Eighteen seconds. Three ah. have damage. <laughs> Doesn't sound like he has too much though, so he'll probably pass us. Thirteenth, huh? I thought I just kissed the wall. I feel like I knocked the whole damn rear toe out. Not so bad. Still a long way to go though. Being behind you didn't look like you kissed it. You bounced pretty hard off of it. Really? It, it felt gentle. To me, I thought you just had some left wheel in it, and it just pulled back to the left, but after I thought about it more, it's almost like a wall catapulted you back to the center of the track. So we'll be on the inside. Yeah, I was, I was one, uh, one branch on the wall too early blending out. I guess that's the preferred place to be. I'm not sure. It's like driving a modified, huh? Forget where that right side is. Hopefully uh, we get things sorted out. It's usually most scary on these restarts. First couple of laps to start this race were pretty wild. And then everyone kind of got spread out a bit. Imagine it's going to be the same story here. One to go. Next time by. Line up on the inside. Race will resume at the end of this lap. Much higher up than I uh, than I thought, though. I guess those people that got trapped, plus some people with damage, maybe. We'll be in front of them for now. Just gonna do second gear again. That worked just fine before. We were hesitating for the people in front of us on the initial start, anyway. So second gear should work just fine. Got about 39 to go. Sounds about right. Let's see what happens. About to go green. Stay focused. Ice car is in. Green, 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 green. Pretty good start for the inside row, or the inside line. Still there, hold your line. Still there, hold your line. Not doing any three wide nonsense. Not to let the nose push. Getting off the throttle pretty good. So we we'll get some turn. Stay low, there's a car on the high side. 
Oh, guy in the wall almost comes and gets me. That'll give us a good angle into this corner. 33 or 30 hits the apron. I'm surprised he kept as mo much momentum as he did. Though he did lose a lot. Whew. I knew it'd be crazy. I knew we had some craziness coming up. That we did. Our water temperature is kind of high. I'm keeping an eye on it. I think it'll be okay. Just done We're not going to be in such a tight group forever. Plus, the tires are going to make us lift off more and more. Over time, should be okay. Three behind us. We got that little bit of damage, but I don't think they're going to be behind us forever. <laughs> they'll, they'll probably get by us. Without much problem. Eventually. Unless the damage is worse than, uh, than expected from 18 second repairs. Being a little bit more aggressive this run, I don't think it's going to do much for me, but. I wasn't good short run or long run last time, so at least this time I'll be a little bit more competitive short run. Plus, maybe I'm getting on the right rear. Maybe that'll be a good thing. That feels pretty good, honestly. I wonder if maybe the temperature's going down on the track as the night comes in. I wonder if those are uh, making this setup kind of come into its own here as the night falls the car comes alive <laughs> we got a wear car V12. thirty to go or like twenty nine and a half right now Kinda of liking how it feels being a little more aggressive halfway through the corner. Seems like I'm being able to carry some speed and maybe it's not so bad. Maybe it'll be on the right rear and it won't cost us too much. We'll see. Twelfth place though right now. I'm very happy with that. And I feel like this. Free setup. You know I'll take that. Let's see uh, where we end up. It definitely feels more fun to drive now, at this point in the race. It's early in the race, it was just so tight. Now it feels like I'm actually getting some turn. It's more enjoyable, that's for sure. Seems like guys behind are catching up though, probably doing better with tires. Lots of movement in front of us. 
They're really wiggly up there. Two by two in front of us. Gonna have a good run on us. pretty well there actually no now we're getting tight Stick your nose there. That would have been really stupid if that Tim put his nose there. Because I would have had nowhere to go. Like was, the guy above me is not going to be ready for three wide. Flat foot it. <laughs> Hello. Hey, Matt. So we're falling back a bit. Not the worst, though. Got a huge run. I don't want to take it, though. I think the tin's much faster than me right now. Getting much tighter. Whoa. <laughs> and he does not look like he's tight at all. Quite the opposite. I wish I was driving that car. We're still not unbearable, though. We can still wheel this thing a little bit. Just got to get off the throttle a little longer, I think, in order to keep up. Fifteenth place at the moment. I'm sure I'm not going to slide up into this guy. It's pretty close, but I was able to take the corner how I wanted still. Oh my gosh, he really loves sticking it right below the guy's in front of him. Just really for no reason. I can't see why he would want to do that. I feel like it's just slowing him down in the corner. A 
lift for him a little bit there. He didn't have a good corner on the, a good runoff at least. Don't do it to me! Oh man, he killed a really good run right there. Kind of getting these higher lanes hooked up. All of a sudden we're moving on the higher lane. Okay. Gotta love that. As soon as you want to try to hire lane, and there's someone dying up there. This is intense. I have a feeling he was going to put his nose there, no matter what. Fighting, there's not much time to go in this race. Gotta hit my marks. Haven't been as consistent as I would like to be. Oh, the yellow flag! Oh, yellow flag. <laughs> of course. Well, now this is gonna be really interesting. Single file behind car number 10. Ooh. We're under caution, pits are closed. Wonder what happened. Your engine temperatures are looking better now. Well, I'm glad I fought for the spot there. Much track positions we can get for the late restart, but I'm kind of scared Here it's going to be messy. Keep going, guys. Well, since it's so close to the end, we're going to do that. That might be a mistake. But we're going to get as much as we can out of this car. And the setup might need some help. Need a good pit stop here. Got it stopped. 7184, still on the right front. Wonder if we'll have any two tire takers or anything. That did go. Yellow 
You only have one type yet remaining. They want you right. to single file. Making sure no one's around me. Very competitive right there. I think the 30 took two tires, maybe. Might have been a lot of guys that did. The left sides weren't so bad. Maybe that was a play. I don't know. Car's loose enough, I feel like, on the, you know, cold tires for the first couple of laps, and, well, first couple of laps are all we're going to get by the time this thing restarts. Let's see. So we were in 14th. I think we only lost a couple spots from guys making choices. Oh, no, nope, still 14th. Okay. Interesting. The other Colton in here has left, so I guess we'll be the top finishing Colton at least. <laughs> For whatever that's worth. Nothing. It's going to be six to go. Something like that. Oh boy, I'm nervous. Got a little bit of extra tape on this thing. Should be able to last us though. It's only a little bit more. I wonder if I should have put fuel in it to get it uh, turning. I don't know. I'll be happy if I just survive this and finish at or above my car number. That's looking pretty good at this point, if I can survive. I gotta say though, the setup really came around. That second run, it was much better than it was the first run, so I guess it's uh, you know, the track temps were more favorable. Second half of the race, maybe. For how this thing's set up. I guess that's what was going on. You guys can keep going, I'll be there. Alright, the outside. I don't know if that's where we want to be or not. I feel like if there's a wreck, it's going to be hard to avoid if we're up here. Alright, it's nervous time. Six laps. Hopefully it'll be green to the end. Let's uh, catch up. About to go green. Stay focused. I'm in a gap trying to get a jump. I don't know. The pace car is off. Be ready. Green, green flag. Green flag. Green flag. Okay. Love to hear clear. Love to hear that. Don't stick your nose there. Oh, we can only. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, got a caution. I think we're still just in 14. It's closed. Every record so far has been from 20 of them back. Or every yellow. I ain't gonna lie, I needed that. I'm at 80 tape. <laughs> 80 tape? Wow, he pushed it harder than I did. Like 80 news, too. 
So still 14th. Uh, so we can hold it get together behind us, I guess. I feel like we can hold our own. Nah, Lays ain't that smart. <laughs> you can throw a bunch of tape on the nose, you gotta tighten it up a little bit. Oh, I, I knew what to do. So just loose. Oh man. Play see that? He's second guessing you. Boy, you better not be talking. <laughs> Will this be a green light record? Not sure. Hey, let me start a pick, bro. Oh, you don't want to restart behind John. Yeah. I think it is going to be one of our green-white checkers. I'm pretty sure you get three of them in the open series before they call it. Before they say, uh -uh. They let Matt back in the top here. Holy shit. He said let. Yeah, they were anyone up there these days. He drove his way up here. Well, I don't think we uh, wore too much of the tires in that little short run, so we're just gonna do it all again. It's our open. Green, white, checkered style. Really would like to get to the end. It's been a pretty clean race so far, but now we're starting to get a bit messy. There's a green white checkered finish. Green. Green. Officially a green white checkered. Closed. Pit road is closed. Pit car is out. Pits are closed. Man, I'm ready to go. We don't need this extra lap. Can we survive? I don't know if anyone actually did take two tires. I could have been wrong on that. But feeling pretty good, even if this ends poorly. I feel like I did a, a pretty decent job driving One this thing three. to a good okay. spot. In such a strong field. Especially having uh, practiced with three different free setups. And not even deciding on one until after qualifying. <laughs> I'll take that for sure. I'll take that every time. If y'all didn't know, uh, Ken Block has passed away. I don't know who that is, but that's us. Tommy's over here using psychological game, you know? That's not really fair in the 11th hour of the race. Anyway. No, I, no, no psychological games. Like, I literally just read it on Twitter. Ah, oh, bro. Wrong time. No, like, you're right. But, like, could have saved it for after the race instead of, like, everybody upset now. I'm just upset we had caution. Alright, let's you're let this be the only green one checkered. I'm sure hope. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, I got it. I He's going down the apron down there. Clear inside. Inside. Got a good 
good run up here. Gotta check up though. Holy cow, almost got him. Six sticks his nose. White flag, this is it. Stick! Come on, car, stick! It didn't. Oh boy. Oh god, we just finished three wide. Holy smokes. Oh, okay. Fourteenth. What a finish. That was wild. Scratched and clawed our way to a fourteenth. Whew. Need time to get the shakes out of my hands. And then we will give them a... Good one, Brett. Race, good win. Whew. That was crazy. Really got worried there when we ended up three wide near the end. But I was able to hold my line. And somehow held off a run from a, above and behind, <laughs> below me. Had to use the apron. Kind of follow the guy below me under the apron. I don't know if I uh, edge him out if I don't take that route down there. I'm going to go ahead and watch that. Let's see, where did we uh, do that final green white checkered? Right here. Yeah, going to go ahead and watch that back. I didn't do the greatest job, but I did what I needed to do. I at least held position. Got a great run here, but they got stacked up ahead. I almost got to the back of this guy. Had to lift off. That killed my momentum, but I... Tried to get down low. The six, though, got his nose, so I couldn't take it exactly how I wanted. I didn't see he took the apron there, otherwise I probably would have gone a little lower, but I didn't really need to, I guess. Here, I tried to stick the higher line, but it did not stick. You can see I had to lift off late in the corner, and the 28 got a much better run through there. He decided to follow me. Interesting. And after I got tight in 1 and 2, I knew I had to back it down. I wasn't going to get much grip here. But it was enough to get me the spot. They're racing with the guys around me. Gave each other room and we're able to finish it off clean. We got ourselves a 0x. Gained about 19i rating. 14th place may not seem like much, but in a 5k strike the field, I am very happy with that for sure. I mean, I was the 18 car, for goodness sakes. That never happens. So I'm pretty happy. We finished ahead of a pro driver <laughs> who quit on uh, like lap 2, but. We don't have to pay attention to that fact. <laughs> Alright. So we will watch the incidents. See what happened out here to bring out the couple of cautions we did have. Lap 1. Got on a wall a little bit. There we are three wide on lap 2 already. 31 kind of just comes down off the corner a little bit. Maybe he was watching the guy getting loose up ahead. More three wide on lap two. 12 pinches. 12 maybe didn't get enough room, give enough room for three wide. But everyone keeps it going straight. Until he gets the wall. Yikes. It was pretty crazy early on. Oh, that looks like some serious wall. Maybe the 23 pressuring that a little bit. 27 gets off the gas just in time. I 
Just a little bit of wall there, not even. Moving along pretty quick though, lap 21 already. Nine tries the high line and it doesn't work. He gets in the wall real bad. Just some wall, nothing too serious. Kendrick car in the wall, just a bit. Three had some damage, is this what from what? Got a pretty good chunk of it. Hmm. Well, the six kind of sticks his nose out there, like that's kind of the position I was in before, like, you know, we're lap 32, people are probably starting to get a little bit tight. So the five's expecting to be able to go out to the wall here, and the six is sticking his nose there. I mean, you could say, like, five, not clear. But, I mean, he, you kind of have to expect him not to be able to get the car to turn. So, I don't know, it feels like you're stepping in front of a moving train, doing something like that. I don't know. Tough, tough situation. much going on there. Some guy's getting real loose at the end of the long run at the start. I was uh, not. Oh, yikes. So this is that same thing again, I think. The 19's expecting to be able to go to the wall. 25 sticks his nose out there. I mean, I don't know there's much the 19 can do. I mean, it, you, can, you can almost see like how hard he's turning the wheel left, trying to keep, him, keep it off of him. But the car's tight. So it's just a dangerous spot to put yourself in as the 25. It's the same exact thing that happened before, but it was much worse this time. I remember the 25 saying, not clear. But, you know. It's tough. Three wide. Ooh. They're all bouncing off of each other. Not much going on there. We're approaching whenever people started heading into the pits before the first caution. Team getting real sideways. What's happening here? Nothing. A whole lot of nothing. Just guys uh, reaching the end of their tire life, I think. That's what we're seeing a lot of. Or getting pretty sideways. Fifteen is pitting, and I assume that's our caution. Man, it shouldn't be though. Oh. Okay. Okay. Caution did come out. That sucks. He was down on the apron. I don't think that should have been a caution. Hold on a second. Is that the green? Okay, yeah. For a second, I thought that was yellow. It was so far away, it was hard to tell. I don't think this should have been a caution. When does it come out? Right there. I guess he's just too close to the racing surface, but I feel like he's on the apron. Oh, well. So we didn't have to do a green flag pit stop, for better or for worse. lap 55. Ryan, our outside gets the wall. I gave him room, though. I'm sure I was very grateful to have the outside clear right there. I could take my corner. 
Man, I really felt like I was driving a cardboard box with a bunch of people in spaceships around me. <laughs> I really feel like I'm... I mean, it's that's probably not the case. I'm sure the setup's fine. And I'm sure there's plenty of other guys out there that are on the OSR setups and stuff, but that's what it feels like to me a lot of the time. Like, I'm really just having to get everything I can. You know, put a fresh coat of paint on, the, on my cardboard box and head out there and act like I belong. <laughs> that's what it feels like a lot of the time. Not sure what happened to this guy. Blow an engine? I don't even think I saw this happen. Yep, that's a blown engine. Wow. How about that? That was a spot I didn't know I gained for free. What were these other cautions that came uh, came upon us later? I think it was like lap 80-something we got our next one, wasn't it? We're pushing up a little bit. Put me 11 pretty close to the wall. Oh, is that retaliatory? Four pushes him up pretty bad. Eleven kind of turns into him, shows displeasure, but it just kind of slowed him down more, I think. Ooh, 22 in the wall, pretty good there. Oh, that's the guy, okay. <laughs> that's when I decided, yeah, I'll try to run the high line. It kind of worked last lap. Oh, okay, well there's a guy in that line now. I still was able to take it, alright. Highline just didn't work as well as I hoped it would, unfortunately. I actually got the wall a tiny bit. Just that nose felt like it was pushing the whole race. Really hard to deal with. I think the 6 probably hates me. I feel like I was like in his way the whole race. Like I was just holding him off on the outside, even though he was probably faster. Felt like I didn't really belong in front of him, but I <laughs> I was a lot of the time. And then we finished three wide, and I finished barely ahead of him. <laughs> we definitely raced hard. I, I feel like I ended up racing him specifically a lot. I think he might not like me. <laughs> I don't know. I have never talked to the guy, really. I don't know. I like racing him. I feel like we're usually pretty similar speeds, and... Uh, usually have some tough competition for, that, for what that's worth. What's happening here? Oh! Okay, well, something not good. But the 14's getting loose, I guess. Can't quite hold on to it. He's just kind of wiggling, paying to wreck. And then the 15 can't avoid him. And he just kind of didn't slow down. I guess it was hard to tell where it was going to be, but I don't know, I feel like I would slow down a little bit more than that. But then again, like, you slow down a whole bunch, and then he saves it, and then you lost the pack. So, that's just, uh, let's go ahead and just say, hey, 14, probably don't do that. <laughs> Hold on to the car a little bit better. Maybe, uh, pay for a setup that you can control. I don't know. Not uh, sure what we're missing there. Got one more caution to go, I believe, and there it is. Got another guy getting loose. On cold tires, I assume. It's the 31. Got a lot of wheel in it, maybe, to get it turning, and then it snaps on him. And then the 17 can't react in time. And uh, I guess that was the caution. Everyone's slowing down now, so... Got sideways enough, it brought it out, probably right there, the 9. So that's what brought upon our, uh, our brought about our green-white checkered. 14's got some serious damage. And he's just gonna rear end the guy in front of him. And restart. And then they're going to wreck on the white flag lap. I wonder what this was here. So they're three wide. I 
I don't know, I guess maybe he had a bump and came up and got the 14. Not sure. Bit of a messy finish for those guys, though. And the 14 is going to hit the wall in pretty much the same spot he hit it earlier. But he had a rough one. And that'll do it for a very strong strength of field here at Chicago Land. B open. And uh, a solid finish. Mid pack, pretty much. Not the top half of the mid pack, though. You know, we got 14th out of 31. Has the 18 better than I'm supposed to finish. And uh, absolutely 100% very happy with that. So uh, I hope you enjoyed. It was a pretty exciting race, I think. Lots of side by side action, that's for sure. And then we go ahead and cross the finish line three wide. So lots of fun stuff. Hey, check that out. My fastest lap was the final lap. I pulled it off when I needed to, huh? How about that? 31-1. That's pretty good compared to the other laps I was running. And obviously we're going full speed. Full speed ahead at the end, but... I didn't even think it was that great of a lap. But, uh... That'll do it here. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Have a good one.